We're going to find the integral of sine squared of x dx, and we're going to need a couple of trig identities to do that. The very first trig identity that we need is this power reduction formula for sine squared. There's a similar one for cosine squared, but let's go ahead and put this sine squared identity in, and this changes our integral. I'm just going to replace the sine squared x. It changes my integral to be 1 minus cosine 2x all divided by 2 and then a dx. Now I can pull the divided by two outside of my integral as a one half. So I'm gonna write one half integral, and that leaves me on the inside with a one minus cosine two x, and then my dx. Now I can go ahead and integrate the one, which goes to x, and I can integrate that negative cosine. The integral or the antiderivative of cosine is sine. So I'm gonna keep the negative. I end up with a sine of 2x. Because I've got that constant multiplier two on the inside, we could use a u substitution or we could go ahead and use this shortcut of dividing by a constant multiplier. So I've got that divided by two. Um, this is a one half out in front of everybody. This is an indefinite integral, so I'm going to add that plus c as well. Let's clean this up. I'm going to go ahead and move the 1 half through. So I end up with 1 half x, and then I get minus. That's going to be a 1 over 2 times 2. So how about a 1 over 4 sine of 2x plus c? There's one more version of the solution, and it uses that second identity for the sine of 2x. If I go ahead and apply that, so if I apply the second identity, I'm going to leave the 1 half x. I get 1 fourth, and I'm going to go ahead and replace my sine of 2x with 2 sine x cosine x. Of course, there's a plus c on the outside, and we can cancel those. This is going to make our final answer 1 half x. This is just another version of it minus canceling the 2 and the 4. I get another 1 half, and then sine x cosine x plus c. I hope you did great. Take a look at this next video so you can see how to integrate a power 4 on a cosine. Thanks so much for watching.